Hey everyone, Dr. Menti here with another Meant to Be Well Minute. Does your child's backpack feel like a 50 pound bag of rocks? You may have noticed that your child struggles to get it on first thing in the morning and may even need help pulling the straps together enough to click it into the buckle. Moreover, researchers and healthcare organizations are growing more concerned about the effects of the extra weight on your child's developing spine. It's estimated that over 60% of children routinely carry backpacks that weigh more than 10% of their body weight. Now for some children, that may mean that they're carrying a backpack that's nearly identical to their own body weight. Now this is a big deal because researchers have found that carrying heavy backpacks increase the risk of back pain in children by a whopping 50%. The good news, you've got their back. Focus on the ergonomics, focus on the fit and the packing. So you wanna select an appropriate size backpack, no wider than their torso. You wanna make sure that it sits more than four inches below their waist. You wanna use both straps to balance the weight and to ensure that they are you know, snug so that the backpack doesn't hang too low. You also wanna teach your child to place the heaviest items towards the bottom of the backpack and to use all the compartments so that you could distribute the load. Now, one benefit of the e-learning movement is that digital versions of these computerized uh, books are replacing these heavy textbooks. Now, unfortunately, uh, the long hours of e-learning are gonna have challenges of their own, which you will soon find out. Now, most experts agree that a backpack shouldn't weigh more than 10% of the child's body weight, and backpacks that are too heavy can lead to back and neck pain, as well as poor posture. Now, if your child has developed poor posture or neck and back pain, please let us know. We'd be happy to evaluate their posture and their movement so that we can correct anything that's going on that isn't right and to obviously remove these concerns so that we don't have any problems in the future for them. Now, I hope that you found this helpful. Until next time, I'm Dr. Menta. Be well.